Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley is celebrating the news that Caribbean Airlines has recorded a profit of $96 million in 2018. He made that statement at Cal's Customer Appreciation Ceremony at the Hyatt Regency on Wednesday night. Dr. Rowley said it's been almost a decade since the state carrier showed any semblance of profitability and the fact that Cal is having a profitable year in 2018 is truly good news and spells stability. For the first nine months of the year, it reports a healthy operating profit of 96 million Trinidad and Tobago dollars. It's a noticeable achievement that net income for the year to date rose 15% in over 2017. That's by almost 300 million TT dollars. The Prime Minister noted that six years ago, Cal was struggling with losses in the region of 1.3 billion TT dollars, even before the fuel subsidy and government support. And he said over the past year, the airline faced financial challenges connected to the cost of fuel. Caribbean Airlines has had to manage a rise of over 100 million TT dollars in its fuel bill. And yet, it has still managed to make an operating profit and be positive in its earnings before interest and taxes. The Prime Minister said the gains could be even better if Caribbean Airlines could charge the break-even cost for travel on the airbridge. However, he said that would mean doubling the current fare from $300 to $600, but it's not the intention of the government to adjust the fare at this time.